Good day, my farm and friends. How the heck are you? Welcome back to the dynasty that it is. My fancy pickup truck. Oh, it's a beautiful day. It is a beautiful day. I'm going to stop here. You know what? Oh, Becky. I got to stop and say hi to Becky this fine and outstanding morning. Oh, she's working. Hey, Becky. Come back here. Hey, where are you going? Becky. I want to talk to you, Becky. Come here, Becky. Jump the fence. Becky. Hi. Good morning. Not now. Sorry. Oh, yeah. No way. You're going to talk to me. Come on. Get your head up. Don't just kick the grass. Come on. I'm busy. No, you're not. You're not doing anything. You're just picking a weed for crying out loud. Oh, hi. Here to talk. Good morning, friend. Friend? I want to be your friend. Hey, let's just start off nice easy. Nice weather, ain't it? It sure is. There's nothing wrong with Becky's forehead. I think a little bit. Uh, did you, did you hear the latest news? I heard they opened the old mill again. Really? I haven't heard that, Becky. You are. Oh, you look pretty today. You look so pretty today. It is so nice to hear. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. You're welcome, my dear. I'll see you later. Bye-bye. You want to give me a little wave? Oh, hug? 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 Oh, that's a nice hug. Yeah, your forehead's a little... What? Sign language? No, okay. What, another hug? Oh, okay, one more hug. Then I got to go, Becky. Bye-bye. Oh, I tell you. Crazy women. Can't live with them. Can't shoot them. Anyways, bye, Becky. I'll see you later. I had to come by and see Becky this morning. You know, um, Sybil was the other lady, but uh, I went up to talk to Sybil, but she runs the uh, windmill, and that must be her husband, so uh, that's not that's a no-go. That's a no-go. I've talked to a few other people here in the past couple weeks, but um, nobody seems to be real interested in me. Sad. It's so sad. It is actually the 24th of September. It's been a couple weeks, and uh, I've been working hard. I've been doing some um, missions. I've been doing some work around the farm and kind of got things up and running. I'm, I'm trying to improve the uh, social status, but um, it is what it is. So what I want to do today, I did hire a local farmer because I was so busy with all other stuff that he came by and fertilized my fields. And I'm thinking perhaps maybe I will, uh, what are you doing, man? Let's go. Is there something going on here? What, what's, what's happening? Oh, the Prius guy. The Prius guy is causing trouble again. Damn you, Prius guy. Anyways, I, I'm thinking, you know, if Becky, Becky's kind of fond of me. She, she really does like me. And I'm thinking that, uh, you know, in order to, um, what's the word I'm looking for? To make her like me more? I think that I'm going to need to uh, fix up the old farmstead. I'm going to need I'm going to need to do some work. Oh crap, that was a sharp turn. Uh, fix up the old farmstead, do some work there and see how it goes. Now, let's see. Oh, the band. Look at all that fancy machinery over there. I tell you what. I wanted to go to the um, Here's where I want to go. I want to go Oh yeah, I got to keep going and then take a right. I'm going to go up to the building supply store because I think I'm going to get some building supplies for the farm and start working on that, kind of getting the farm up and ready to go. I have been doing some research, to be honest with you, and I'm kind of thinking that at the end of September, it just automatically switches over to April from what I can understand, from what I can read, but I'm not 100% sure on that, so I don't think that I, I can, and from what I also understand is wheat and canola can be planted in the fall and be ready to go, sit dormant over the winter, but I don't want to plant wheat or canola, so I'm not going to worry about that. But we're going to pull in here to the building center, the building materials, and we're going to buy a few things, and we're going to start fixing up the house because the house looks kind of shabby. It looks a little uh, grandma-ish. Yep, yep, like uh, where you'd find naked grandma. If you ever saw that uh, Family Feud one, that that was, no, Family Feud? Yeah, naked grandma. Anyways, um, so here's what I want to get. And here's the other thing. I, I have... 5,164 bucks. I want to be careful how I do this. Uh, I do have a bunch of eggs and milk that I, when we get back to the farm that I can um, that I can sell. And that'll be a little extra money. But I also want to fix, start fixing up some rooms. So I don't know. I'm thinking, should we put on a ceramic roof or should we put on a shingled roof? I'm kind of thinking a ceramic roof might be a little more classy. That is 447 euros where the shingles, um, are these the shingles? They're kind of ugly though. 391, so the, oh, that's a metal roof plate. Um, I thought there was shingles around here somewhere. Uh, tile, I need to buy some tile ceramic floor. 
I need to buy yeah shingles four well shingles are 424 huh I thought maybe the ceramic roof would have been more but um, 424 447 so I'm gonna spend a little bit of money and we're gonna buy some stuff we're gonna buy some ceramic roof I'm gonna buy some new brick I'm gonna replace the bricks in the house so we're gonna buy some new bricks and then I need to buy some now that ceramic tile is 557 I think this is the same thing as over here 557 558 <laughs> what's the difference uh, depending where you where you buy them from so well, we're gonna buy some tile and then uh, I need to buy some scratch coat for the walls so we got to buy a scratch coat and then we have to buy a finishing coat so we got to buy a finishing coat as well um, wood glaze I'm not so sure about the wood glaze yet and then we have uh, concrete plaster I'm not so sure about that either I'm trying to think. Concrete plaster, I think, goes on the uh, the wall. And then I also need to buy some wood planks. That'll help fix up the wood around the house. So I think that's a good start. So the scratch coat we're going to do on the walls. And the finishing coat. I thought I could have changed color on that, though. Maybe that was wood glaze? Because one of them you can change color, I think. I don't know. But anyways, we're going to start with that. We're going to see how it goes. I have all the supplies up here. And we're, the problem with it is I, I wish there was a difference because you can only pick one at a time. And you have to come up here and select which one you want. So in order to make this easier for me, because you're going to use one and then go to the other one, if I leave the pick up here and uh, pick one and then go home, I can just you know jump into the pickup and then select the other one. It's, it's, it's a little thing I don't really care for too much, but it is what it is. So what should we do first? Roof, brick tile i think we probably do the walls so we want the scratch coat so i can only pick that up so i'm going to pick up the scratch coat and then i'm going to head home and we'll start with the walls on there and then when we get there we can sell some stuff and see what we got going on i, th I think i did eggs and milk this morning but i better double check so i'll see you back in the farm in just a jiffy now here's the other thing um because it's been a couple weeks the greenhouses so we can, we can also pick up some uh, vegetables here and get some new stuff in the ground. So look at that. We got uh, chili peppers. Ooh, chili peppers. We might as well pick all those chili peppers. I like chili peppers. Pick Oh, bell pepper. Bell pepper, chili pepper, bell pepper. Same thing. And then we'll pick all these. So it's been a couple weeks. Um, what do we have here? We have tomatoes. Oh, I like tomatoes. We'll pick up some tomatoes. Oh, yeah, we're going to be rolling in the dough here with all our um, vegetables. In our greenhouses then we'll get these things up and running <coughs> excuse me holy crap that was a, a slimy moth uh cucumbers we have cucumbers so we'll pick up some cucumbers now i think everything is ready let's double check that farm statistics here i think um tomato seedlings yeah everything's ready to go humidity is low let's see um farm buildings fixed everything's fixed Cows. We still have some cow food. We have. Oh yeah, we do have eggs and and milk to pick up. So we gotta do that too here. Oh crap! I got all kinds of stuff to go on. I thought I was getting kind of up here, but um, maybe not. Maybe not. Oh Becky. Oh Becky. You know, it's it's interesting because Becky is quite fond of me, and I bought her some chocolates and I bought her some flowers, but apparently she doesn't want to. Um, doesn't want, doesn't, want, doesn't, doesn't want to really accept my flowers or my chocolates. So we'll see how it goes. More bell peppers. Oh, zucchini. Look at that. Oh, we got some fancy zucchini there. And more chili peppers. More chili peppers. Chili peppers. Chili peppers. Chili peppers. Chili. My goodness. How in the world am I carrying all these vegetables? Oh, my God. We got pumpkins. Holy crap. Huge pumpkins. Is that Halloween? Well, it's getting there. Um, and then we have melons. Oh, wow. Look at those. Look at those honking huge melons. How do they even stay on there? That's amazing. Bell peppers, bell peppers, bell peppers. Holy cripes. We got all kinds of stuff. So that ends the greenhouse. Um, we should have some seed here, don't we? Let's see. Um, I can't remember which one is the most. Let's see. Let's put in zucchini, I think. I think zucchini is a uh, profitable one. So we'll plant some zucchini here. We'll do one row of zucchini. That's pretty good. Okay. Um, what else do we got? I wish there was a price list. Maybe there is a price list. No, I want, I want, I want to choose something else. Why do, you, why do you do that? Why do you do that? Why? 
Stop it! Why do you do that? Okay. I want to use the seeds. It just I, it automatically goes. We might have to come back. Yeah, I don't want to plant all this zucchini. I want to choose a different seed. Let me choose a different seed. I'll have to come back. Stupid greenhouse. Stupid chickens. Anyways, it is what it is. So, we got that done. Uh, let's see. Shut the door there. Let's see. Tractor is still there. That's pretty good. Yeah, the green bin looks pretty nice. Um, we'll go check on the cows here. I did buy, as you saw in the beginning, I, I did, um, oh yeah, I forgot to tell you that. In the beginning, I did uh, sell the uh, wheat, went up to the uh, windmill and sold the wheat, and then um, bought more cows. So I am maxed out on cow space. I am. I got nine. We can have nine cows in our barn. Open. Sesame. And we have nine cows. I did sell the trailer load of bales you saw. I was not I was expecting more money. 524 uh, bucks for that. But, oh, that's a nice rear end. Come on, cow. Oh, I'm a good milker. I'm a good milker. Yes, you can milk anything with nipples. That's what they tell me. But I'm just going to milk cows. I, I don't think I want to milk chickens. I don't think I'm going to milk chickens. Just a cow. Come on, cow. Let's milk. Oh, you're a good milker. Wait, oh, crap, cow, did you fall down? I think, oh, yep, get up, cow. I'm all ready. Milk the cows. <laughs> Tell you what, milk the cows. It's just funny. It's just funny. You're a good milking cow. Get up. Lazy cows today. Lazy cows. So with all this uh, milk that we're getting, I can uh, condense it, make a little bit more money, I think. I'm, I'm, I'm very excited to get down to the to the market there and sell all my stuff and see what I end up with because um, I'm thinking that I probably, you know, when I had enough money, the first thing I thought of was buying buying a tractor, but I don't think that's the most important thing because um, if I can make enough money, I can, you know, subcontract some of my farming work and I think fields. And the other thing I found out is that fields farther away from me are less expensive than the ones right around me. So maybe we might have to go field shopping out in the uh, boonies, but I'm interested to see what's going to happen here at the end of September if we do jump to April, which is my understanding. But um, we'll kind of go from there. Okay, so we got that done. Let's see, got the vegetables picked. We got the uh, cows taken care of. Let's go over the chickens real quick. Um, we'll get the eggs, and then we'll run inside. We'll maybe do some cooking. Oh, crap, I went the wrong way. Maybe do some cooking. And then head into the market, and then we'll check out our scratch coat. This is going to take me oh, quite a while. It's going to take me quite a while, but like with the wood planks, we can refurbish this chicken coop, which we, I think we should get more eggs for. Refurbish the fence, the little gazebo over there. We can put some new brick on there. Um, all we have is like a uh, OSB board roof. So we got to get some uh, ceramic shingles on there. So that's why I bought all that stuff, and I was kind of excited to do that. But uh, it's okay. I'm going to pick up the eggs here. And we'll go do some cooking, and then we'll head up to the, um, oops, get eggs. We'll head over to the market, we'll sell some stuff, and see how much money we uh, make up. Because I want to do some remodeling, too, inside the house. And that is impressive. That is impressive. I, I, I enjoy that. But um, let me get the eggs, and I will be right back with you. Got all the eggs. Oh, my gate's closed. Got all the eggs done. I did some cooking. So I'm gonna head up to the market. I'm gonna see if this stuff is worth anything. If not, then I'm just gonna keep it for myself or my pantry. But I was a holy crap, wild boar! Oh, where's my gun? Oh, I almost said a bad word there. Uh, oh, a deer too. I have wild boars and deer running across my. Uh, where are you going, wild boar? Man, I need to get a gun. All I can buy is a fishing pole. I can, man, I can fish a wild boar. Can you fish wild boar? I don't know. And then a deer just ran right through the store here. Anyways, we're just going to see what this stuff is worth. Because if it's not worth much, I am going to um, keep it in my pantry. But let's talk Good to John. To you. Can I help you? Care to trade? Sure. What do you need? No, I'm going to sell you a bunch of stuff. So, here's what I've got. I've got 80 cans of tomato soup. <laughs> 80 cans of tomato soup. So... How much is 80 cans of tomato soup worth? 702 bucks. Okay. I have 301 eggs. Holy criminy, look at that. That is worth 2300 bucks there. I really don't need the eggs. I get eggs every day. So let's sell those. That's that's a good chunk of change. Um, I have 17 can I can some melons. 
So I have 17 canned melons. Okay, they're not worth anything. Only $189. I have some canned pumpkin soup. That's not really worth anything. I have some canned pickles. $280. I have 300 canned peppers. Holy crap, look at that. 300 canned peppers for 20 Yeah, let's sell those. We'll sell those. And then we have um, zucchini soup. So that's not too much. So maybe some of this stuff I can keep for myself. Um, let's see, condensed milk. I get milk every day. I don't need that, so we'll sell that there. Uh, we'll still, we still have some for our own, though. So, yeah, I think all the rest of the stuff we're just going to kind of keep for ourselves. We did actually make a good chunk of change there. Um, so we're up to 10651 bucks. That's not bad. Thanks, John. Appreciate it, buddy. So that'll at least uh, give us some money to uh, fix up the house. That, that it will. So, let's see. Let's start with the scratch coat. We're going to start on the inside. We'll start off the inside of the house. we got to make it Becky favorable. You know what I mean? Because Becky's not going to want to come to this farm and live in this naked grandma house. Uh, I'm getting a little hungry. Oh, okay. I'll eat something. Let's see. What should I have? I'm going to have a, a tomato soup. I like tomato soup and grilled cheese sandwich. There you go. I'm at 100. Perfect. Okay. So, here's how the scratch coat works. I should have this all set up to go. So, these ugly walls are just hideous. So... We're going to um, rebuild with the con concrete plaster scratch. So we'll do that, and we'll just, oh, yeah. Oh, that's a big difference. Look at that. That is so much nicer. So we're going to redo all these walls here. Oh, yeah. Look at that. That is so much nicer. Get rid of this ugly wallpaper, naked grandma wallpaper. Oh, yeah. That's beautiful. And then we can finish it off after we do the scratch coat on there. Oh, look at that. That looks nice. Um, this is about the most hideous wallpaper I think I've ever seen in my life. Yep, absolutely hideous. So we're going to rebuild that. There we go. Now I think I can do the... Oh, let's do the ceiling too. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's a nice brown ceiling. Oh, that's much nicer. Fix up this ceiling here. Becky will Becky will love my uh, my home. Yeah, that's awesome. That is awesome. Uh, was there a spot that I, I... What? Oh, what? Right there? What is that? What did I miss? Oh, the door jam or something? Maybe? I don't know. Did I get this one? Is there one here too? No? Okay. I got the ceiling. I got the walls. So look at that. That's an improvement, my friends. That looks pretty darn nice. I like it. So basically, we, <laughs> we got to go through the whole room. Um, now, here's what I want to do too. Because the kitchen, I'm going to redo the kitchen. I'm going to redo the kitchen. So when I get back up to the dealership, it's kind of cool. Or the uh, building supply store, I can have them come in. And they're going to put in some new cabinets for me and what have you. Which is which is actually kind of nice. I'm looking forward to that. Come on. I want to do. I want to do the wall here too. There we go. There we go. Oh, that's beautiful. That's beautiful. Oh, the ceiling. I'm not getting the uh, the other one here. There we go. We'll get that done there. I have a lot of walls to do because I got to go upstairs. I don't know why it's not letting me. Why are you only letting me do half the wall? Why can't I do this one? Oh wait, there it is. Apparently, you gotta stand too. You gotta stand farther away. Okay, but I want to get that one. Oh, there we go. There we go. Get the ceiling up here. Look at that. That makes a huge difference. That is an absolute huge difference. So now what I'm gonna do? I got all the walls. Oops, I missed something here. The door jam. Okay. So that should be the whole kitchen. Now, keep an eye on this kitchen. Why, look at this kitchen. I'm going to go up to the... Or I'll, I'm going to go to my pickup truck, and I'm going to grab the ceramic tile. Uh, I'm going to put some tile floor down here, and then I'm going to have them... Um, yeah, let's just, let's just do that real quick. Okay, I think I got the tiles. Yeah, there we go. Okay, got the tiles. So I guess I can do the entryway. I was thinking I could do the kitchen, but I can only do the... Um, the kitchen's got a wood floor, so that's not going to... Look at that. Doesn't that look a lot nicer? I think I think it looks awesome. Um, finish up the floor in here. Apparently, um, maybe I need to grab the wood planks for that. Or maybe if I rebuild the kitchen, um, it'll all come back. Yeah, because I can't, I can't do tile floors on here. Okay. Anyways, let's just re have them redo the kitchen. They put in some new, uh, new fixtures, some new countertops, some new uh, cabinets. So take a look at this. And uh, we'll go up to the store and we'll take a look at the new kitchen. And let's see, on the because they have different rooms here. I'll put that away. I don't need scaffolding inside the house either. Um, I don't know if this is considered the living room. 
It's more of a bedroom, though, because the downstairs bedroom is a little crib there, a little baby. I don't know what, th I, you know, I don't know what room they consider what, because that, um, that goes downstairs. This, you know, it's, it's weird. Another bed, bedroom. Um, so there really is no living room, so I don't know. We'll get up to the dealership, or the, the, the building supply store, and I'll tell you what I mean by that, and we can redo this, um this kitchen but look at that nice floor the walls look so look at look at the difference there that is just absolutely awesome but like i said it's, it's just kind of crazy you can only do one thing at a time but um oh becky's gonna love this becky is going to love this well back up at the building material supply store if we come into here we should be able to get a uh, furniture store the furniture store so for 1250 euros we can redo the kitchen. So we have the kitchen option, we have a bathroom option, we have a bedroom option, a living room option, first kids room, second kids room. So I don't know what room is what, to be honest with you. But let's start with the kitchen. I'm gonna redo the kitchen. So there, I, we just spent all that money to redo the kitchen. And you're gonna, you're gonna see this in a second. And then I'm thinking, I'm gonna redo the living room. Yep, redo the living room. Um, the bedroom, yep, we're gonna redo the bedroom. This is where we sold all that stuff this morning so we have money for all this, and the bathroom. Now, I don't have kids yet, so I'm not gonna be too worried about the uh, for new furniture for the kids' room. I will still um, I will still do that. So, we bought all that new stuff, so we get back to the house. I mean, I tell you what, it's a fast crew. They get down there and work their butts off. So I'm wondering if I still wanna go on, because the finished coat, well, let's just pick up the finished coat and do the entryway there. We'll pick that up. And we'll see if there's a difference there because I thought maybe the I could change color. I, I, I was playing around that I did it. But let's get back and uh, we'll see uh, what the difference is. Okay, I can finish coat. So this is finish coat. Oh, it's like a lighter. Oh, oh, that's kind of nice. I like that. I thought I could change color though. I was pretty sure I could change color. That's not a bad color though, it's kind of neutral. Okay, so that's not bad. We can just finish up with that. Um, yeah, that's actually kind of nice. I don't mind that. I actually don't mind that color, but I was I was pretty sure that I was able to change color, to be honest with you. Um, oh, got even I got a, tr a trim on top there. Oh, I tell you what, Becky's going to be so impressed with me. She is just going to even fall in love with me more. So, that is actually not too shabby. Not too shabby at all. We got new tile floor, we got new walls. So, here is the kitchen. Now, this is, wow. Huh? How do you like them apples? That is not bad at all. That is a gorgeous looking kitchen. Uh, much better than the crap that I had before. So, we'll just finish up the walls here in the kitchen. Um, yeah, get that all nice and neat. Oh, this is a much better kitchen. Becky is gonna be happy in this kitchen, I can guarantee you. If we can just get her forehead taken care of, uh, it'd be so much nicer, but uh, there we go. There we go. Oh, we'll uh, finish coat up top there, the ceiling. Look at that. Actually, I tell you what, my design skills, very nice. Very, very nice. So, oh, crap, forgot a wall. Forgot a wall. Come on, wall. There you are. So I need to get up to the store because I think I can't put tile down here. But I think I could put another wood floor down here. If I go pick up some of the uh, wood, I think I can finish off the floor. I kind of like the rustic look, though, but it's, um, you know, with everything else in here the way it is, I think we should get another floor on there. Now, that to me looks the same. That must be a kid's bedroom. This looks the same. That must be another kid's bedroom. So basically, the living room and the bathroom must be upstairs then, I'm assuming. Let's see. Does the bedroom look any different? Oh, look at that. We got flowers. Actually, is it any different? I can't remember now. Uh, well, it has to be because uh, I paid money for the bedroom. So that must be the new improved bedroom. And but it said living room, though, didn't it? Uh, oh, here's a little. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's, well, that, mu <laughs> that must be it. I mean, I, I paid for a living room, a bedroom, and a bathroom, right? Hey, where's, where in the hell is the bathroom? Um... How do I go to the bathroom? Did I lose the bathroom? That's the deck. Um, where is the bathroom? 
There's got to be a bathroom in this house. I've used it. I've had to have used it. Uh, crap. Wow. That is one big tub. So there's the updated bathroom. I found the bathroom. It's in, it's one of the kids' bedroom. I mean, i got to come all the way downstairs to use the bathroom? Um, crazy. Ah, it is what it is. Yeah, that's that's the bathroom there. So, anyways, look at, look at the big difference. I tell you what, that's kind of nice. I'm going to go up to the store. So we, 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 we've done that. I have a lot of work to do because I have... Oh, we can finish that out. I forgot about the ceiling. Finish off the ceiling there. Um, so we've done kind of the scratch coat. We showed the finished coat. We did the tile floors in here. Uh, we have updated the kitchen. We spent some money doing that because you have to do the scratch coat first because the finished coat won't go on there unless you do the scratch coat, which is kind of ironic. But look at that kitchen. That is a nice kitchen. So I'm going to go up and get some wood planks out of my pickup, and we're going to try to fix this floor here, and then that way the kitchen would all be done, and then I can uh, move on to the next thing. All right, got some wood planks. So let's just try this and see how this looks. Uh, we're going to rebuild the wood floor here. Ooh, ooh, nice. Oh, heck yeah. Look at that. Now that is a kitchen that Becky could be proud of. She could do a lot of good cooking in here. Look at that. There is our updated kitchen. Beautiful. We got new walls, new ceiling. We got new uh, kitchen appliances, new uh, cabinets. Oh, that's so much nicer. So that is the wood uh, floor. So actually, if I wanted to, I could... Um, rebuild the one in this bedroom i wasn't really going to worry about it but once i have it in my hand here you know you, you got to go out and get the next thing so you might as well just do all the wood floors in here rebuild those there we go i went up to the greenhouse to pick the different seed and it still wouldn't let me so i'm working on it i got the chilies in there but um ooh. you know it already did that one um uh, now the wood planks are also going to be good for many things on the outside so i think instead of just keep going back and forth i'm going to start with one thing at a time so check out this old crappy gazebo here this thing is just god awful we're gonna let's, let's rebuild the gazebo let's rebuild the gazebo yeah that looks nice doesn't it oh i tell you what this farm is gonna look look spiffy it is gonna look spiffy that yeah, you betcha i was I don't know. It's one of those things, but um, I think the nicer the farm looks, the better things are going to operate, and the more Becky is going to be impressed with me. It, it's tough spending all that money, but uh, hey, can we fix the little pole here? Nope, I guess not. Okay, we'll just fix, finish up the gazebo here. I pulled out to get some scaffolding out to do the uh, the roof up there. I think you can do the roof. Well, you have to be able to do the roof. Oh, what's that say? Rebuild. There's more planks. Oh, yeah. Look at that. It's fixing the roof. Oh, now that's top notch right there. I think I got one more side here to fix up. And we'll get that. So there's a gazebo. Look at how much nicer that looks. I tell you what, my cat is going to love sitting on here on this gazebo. Oh, beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. That is so much nicer. I don't know if I can fix the bench. Can I fix the bench? No, I can sit on the bench, but I can't fix the bench. So that's a gazebo. The other thing I can fix is the chicken coop. I can go around and do the whole chicken coop and the whole fence. So I'll tell you what. Let me um, let me go do that. We'll turn on some music. We'll speed this up a little bit. And we'll see how it looks. And uh, kind of go from there. chicken coop and fence look i tell you what it's a process and wood planks do not go last very long i have run out um a couple times had to get add more out of my pickup i even had to go buy like three more pallets so it doesn't last very long but i think i got it all oh i can rebuild the uh okay well, we might as well do that get it all done oh yeah that's nice that looks 
pretty darn nice, my friends. I am, uh, well, I'll do this one here too, what the heck. That looks pretty nice. So, that's kind of the gist of it. I have some, you know, I don't know how much time I want to spend uh, going through all this because really, um, what difference does it make? You know, you, you do it once, you do it, uh, and it's a lot of work. I mean, it's a lot of work going in between the two. You got scratch coat, you got finished coat, you got wood planks, you got ceramic tiles, you've got um, all kinds of stuff. I think that, uh, I think that does a pretty good job there. I think we got everything covered. Um, Pretty sure everything covered on the back side here too. Oh yeah, that, that looks so much nicer. We can also redo the fence. I think we could also redo that. I'm kind of curious to see. Oh, look at that. Oh yeah. This is gonna take me a lot of wood planks. Hey, that looks kind of nice. I kind of like that. Uh, a lot of wood planks, matter of fact, to do the whole barn and everything else. But I, you know what? While we're doing it, I might as well just do the whole thing, to be honest with you. Might as well just do the whole shebang. I tell you what, Becky, you're going to have the nicest looking farmyard in the county. So you can even actually do the fence. Make that look nice and new. Look at that. That's actually not too shabby. Not too shabby at all. So I have a lot. I have a lot to do. Um, I'm, I'm just going to keep going with my wood planks eventually because I'm going to get that, that done. I'm going to get the barn done. And then um, we can do brickwork. Yeah, because all that can be done with the wood planks. Oh, I could even probably do the side of the uh, the barn here, couldn't I? Look at that. Oh, heck yeah. Heck yeah. That's not too shabby. I'm going to keep the metal doors. I like the metal doors. Because I think when I, when I first did it, I had uh, wood doors on there. And then I said, no, I want metal doors. I like the metal doors on there. So, I got a huge project now the other thing I'm thinking about is I'm pretty sure that these fields were fertilized let's just double check the because I, I hired the, that done um, fields fallow but it doesn't say it doesn't actually tell me um, if I go into here would it give me the information I'm trying to think Fertilized, 52%. Okay, so I did actually, they, they did come down and do that. Um, fertilized, 42%. I wonder what the difference is. See, now I can, for, I can hire that done, plowing for 318 bucks. So I'm going to do that. And somebody's going to come down, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hire that one done. Uh, I could do it myself, and then I'm going to hire... Let's see. No? Maybe I can only hire one at a time? Why can't I hire that one too? We'll see what happens there. I can I can probably do the other one. Um, we'll at least get one of them done. Because i got a lot of work to do down here. Now, let's see. I'm going to try to think. Where is the... Where is the nearest field from where I'm at? I want to look at prices of... Oh, crap. I forgot a hay bale. There's a... Uh, stra well, straw, hay, same thing. Straw bale laying over there. Hmm... There's got to be a field right around here somewhere. Because I, I, I was just going around and I was checking. Hey, bird, how you doing? Hey, come back here, bird. I like birds. Uh, I was just checking field prices. And it seemed to me that the fields farther away were um, less expensive. Crap, there's a field down there. Let's just run down here and we'll check on this field here. And we'll see what this field costs. Hey, Kyle is down here. Oh, I like it down here. I wonder who lives over there. I could maybe go and visit and say hi. I probably could. Go and visit and say hi. But this field here is not too far away. But this field here would cost me, uh, yeah, well, fifteen thousand plus thirty thousand social points. But I, I mean, I saw fields up north that were like nine thousand bucks. So that's something to think about. Anyways, I don't know what else to do today. See, what time of the day is it? Oh, it's only three, three, almost four o'clock. Um, Oh, I'm all hungry. I better get something to eat. I'll have another tomato soup. Have another tomato soup. There we go. Now we are perfect. Um, well, it's only four o'clock. I got I got more stuff I can do. Let's go check on the greenhouse um, real quick and see if I can get that thing working. Guy showed up in his linder. 
and a plow. He is getting some uh, plowing done here on this field. 318 bucks. That's not too shabby. Um, especially when I got a lot going on. If there are some uh, contractors out who want to do some work on my fields, I'm going to let them. I hate plowing. I absolutely hate plowing. So I don't think that's actually a bad idea. Get down here and get some uh, field plowed for me. Way to use that plow and that Linder tractor. That's absolutely awesome. Absolutely awesome. Man, I should have a new tractor like that. Oh, someday. Someday, someday, you can you can dream in one hand and crap in the other and see what gets filled first, I tell you. Uh, let's see, the greenhouse is going to work now this time. Because I, let's see, what did I plant? I got chili peppers and I got zucchini. So I'm going to try to do, let's do something else. Chili peppers and zucchini. Let's do some cucumbers. There we go. We'll do cucumbers next. I got a row of that, so we'll do a row of cucumbers. Holy crap. Uh, we can have all kinds of cucumbers. There we go. Plant some cucumbers there. A little bit of a glitch when it comes to this stuff. Uh, one. Ah, oh, I'm one short. Ah, uh, one cucumber short. Ah, oh, that's okay. Uh, now. Oh, we have one chili seed left. So let's just put a chili at the end here. That worked out kind of nice. Oh, I'm too short. <laughs> oh, crap, I'm too short. Oh, well. Here, I thought it was going to work out perfectly. Uh... Anything else with one? No. Let's see. Melon. Pumpkin. We'll do some more pumpkin. Um, wasn't the pumpkin soup kind of worth some money? Let's do a whole row of pumpkin. I can't remember. Now I forgot what was worth the most money. But we'll do some pumpkin here. I got a lot of pumpkin seeds. We'll do some pumpkin. Yeah, I think the stuff takes about two weeks to grow. So we'll go with that. Uh, I still had one space left, didn't I? Over here. We'll put one more pumpkin here. Yeah. There we go. So, there, the greenhouse is full. That's finally done. We'll get this activated, get some water on here, and get these into more of a um, comfort zone. There we go. There we go. Beautiful. So, that's done. The guy is plowing. I, st I still have boards. I still have some boards, so I can continue on with the, uh, the wood planks. And, like I said, I've got a lot of work to do because i got to get... You know, the inside done, the outside done. I've got brickwork to do. I've got um, wood planks to do. But I think in the overall project, um, it'll be uh, pretty darn nice. Pretty darn nice. And I kind of like the look. I kind of like the look. I think, you know what? I wonder, now I'm wondering, I wonder if the wood stain, if that makes any difference if changing the color of the wood stain. You know what? Um, let's find out. It's amazing how fast I can get up here. Um, that is air bricks. I don't know why I would need to do that unless it fixes up everything. That's the bit, the bitumen roof. Um, solar panels. We can add some solar panels, but look at how expensive they are. Uh, very, very expensive. So, anyways, the wood glaze. This is... I just bought a thing of wood glaze. We'll give it a shot. I'll put it on there and see what happens. Um, everything else, shingles I don't want. I bought a ceramic roof. So, going over here to the loading dock. We got all kinds of stuff in the loading dock. Yeah, like I said, I bought extra wood wood um, pallets. So let's just try the wood glaze. I'll pick that up. Ooh, I got a paintbrush in my hand. That's cool. Now, rebuild new wood planks with wood glaze. Oh! Look at that! Now that's fancy. That's fancy. Adds a little stain on there. That's kind of nice. I, I was liking the light uh, look, but now that I do that, um, boy, is that nice? That's not too shabby. That is not too shabby. Uh, yeah, I'm okay. Um, I'll tell you what, we'll have this place uh, spick and span here in no problem. No, hey, what's in here? Um, oh, hey, my weed whacker. Oh, my weed whacker's in there. Okay. That's a good spot for it. Um, now, the other thing I want to try to check out is how does that red brick look against that? That would be interesting to know too, wouldn't it? I think so. Went over to my pickup. I pick up some red bricks. Let's just try this here as a little um, experiment. Ooh. Oh, look at that. I'm a good, I'm one hell of a bricklayer. I'll tell you that much. Look at that. Let's just get this one here. Uh, 
There. So that's kind of how the finished product would look. <clears throat> I, I tell you what, that's not too shabby. That is not too shabby. Very red. I wish you could change um, brick color, but you uh, you certainly can't. And like I said, this has been this has cost me um, quite a bit of money. And the problem is, you can't just switch from brick to wood. So you almost you have to do one at a time. And I, the only reason I'm kind of doing all of these different ones is just to kind of show the uh, difference of how it looks and what what it will look like. But um, like now, when I get back into my pickup and select whatever one I want, I'll just have to do one and then go through the whole house and the whole outside and kind of go from there. It's like right now I have brick. So I might as well just stick with the brick. Ooh, I'm stuck in my uh, my header. Just stick with the brick and do all the brick of the uh, house and then um, go back to wood or something. So I'll have to get up there and do wood and then I got to do glaze. and uh, you, you know what I mean. You know what I mean. Look at that. Beautiful. Ooh, look at that. Oh, I like that. That's nice. That is good stuff. The only thing I'm not so sure about... Um, you know, because I can't do anything. This is not brick. That's like, you know, cement blocks or some sort. So I don't know how that's going to work. How's the guy doing? How is the guy doing? Oh, well, you 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 missed a bunch of spots here, buddy. Are you going to come back and get that, or do I have to go up there and do that for 318 bucks? Uh, you're you're missing. You're missing. Well, that's maybe he comes back gets it at the end. I don't know, but um, that's absolutely crazy. Absolutely crazy. So we got to fix the roof up there too. Yeah, I tell you what, that's nice. Well, I don't, you know, let's see, what is it? Oh, crap, now it's getting really late. Time just flies by here on the farm. 58,374 social points. I have 4,443 left in the bank. Um, I'm, not, I'm not sitting too bad, but I don't, you know, the only time, oh, he's coming back to do it. The only time that I'll ever have more money is... The greenhouse, which we got planted again, so we don't have to worry about that. But that, you know, that takes a couple weeks to get more money in there. I will have um, every morning. I got eggs and milk, so that's taken care of. But I didn't think that this uh, this house building project was going to be all that expensive, but it is. I wonder if I buy the other ones. What happens with that? Because you know how a different color it is. Um, I don't know. We'll have to experiment. Oh, can I brick the uh, the well here? Oh, look at that. You can. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's beautiful. That is that is, that is dandy. That is dandy. Well, it's kind of a different uh, little day we had today, but I wanted to try a few things, and I wanted to see how it looked and um, make some money and spend some money. Um, kind of go from there. Because looking at the map, we do have a few things that we have options of. Um... And today we actually, so we can plow a field, 3.14 hectares. That does not sound like fun at all. Uh, we have a transport mission up there. Fix one building. I've done about three of them. So it helps build social points to get the name out there and plow another field. So if I had a different tractor and a better plow, I would be into doing that. These are contests. I think, um, oh, field info. Owner area. I don't know why is. Oh, yeah. Drone. That's a drone race. We can do drone racing. Um... Oh, I didn't know you could do that. So you can look right at the price of the field. Oh, okay. So what field did I walk down to? This one? So that one right there is 30755 Okay, but I was looking at some way up here. Um, 10000 17 27 34 oh, I thought there was some that was less than that. Um, maybe, maybe it was wrong. 21 28 31, 33, huh, I don't know, I thought over there by Becky, there was um, like one for like 9,000, it just seemed cheap, or maybe it was with the social points, this is not telling me the social points, um, yeah, it's like this field here, 33,000 would be a nice one right next to the farm here, these would be nice one, 29, yeah, so that's something to think about there as well, oh, I'm rebuilding again. Yep. Oh, that looks nice. I wish you could change the door. That door is kind of butt ugly. Um, hey, my house. How are you doing? 
So, I think for the remainder of the next couple days, I, you know, there's no sense going through here and just showing you everything that I'm doing. I kind of, I wanted to go through and show you the wood, the stain, uh, the tile, the kitchen, uh, the bricks, the roof. Well, we didn't do the roof, I guess. That's just a ceramic roof. That's not that big of a deal. But our entryway looks a lot, hell of a lot nicer. Look at that. Nice tile. We got some nice little walls in our kitchen. Absolutely dandy. Dandy of it. Oh, I can stain the... Oh, I can stay, I gotta stain the floor. I forgot about that. I gotta stain the floor. That's the problem. I gotta go all the way up to my pickup truck and just change what I want to do. You can't just uh, select it out of your out of your thing and then get it. So I can stain the floor there and then work on work on the rest of the house. So one step at a time, my friends. One step at a time. But that's that looks nice. That looks a heck of a lot nicer. I like it. But we'll leave it there. It's been kind of a different one, but just to show you how we're going to fix up this place, and next time we come back, I should have most of it done. I think I'll have most of it done, so we can kind of get a before and after look as it gets um, later into the evening hours here. Tomorrow morning, I'll get some more eggs, get some more milk, say hi to uh, Becky, and um, next time we'll probably get some farming done. We'll get the, um, we'll probably plow our other field. We'll get we'll get the plow hooked up. We'll plow um, this next field. And then um, this guy better come back and finish all this stuff or I'm going to be very, very angry and he's going to be fired. And um, I suppose we could harrow it then too to smooth it all out, make that nice and neat and uh, kind of, oh, don't run over my scary scarecrow. <laughs> That's an ugly scarecrow. Anyways, you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. Hope the week is treating you well. Take care and we'll see you next time here on Farmers Tuesday. So long.